adding Selenium browser automation to Jenkins. Part of our six module course on building the test automation framework moves on to incorporating Selenium tests in our Jenkins framework. We're well on our way to completing our automation framework that includes Amazon Web Services, Jenkins, Selenium, SOAP UI, JMeter and Git. We're on to module three now where we write some Selenium scripts in Python and add these into our Jenkins automation framework. Some interesting challenges to overcome in this module as we work out ways to start and run Selenium scripts on remote machines. Four areas to cover. We're going to be setting up the Windows Jenkins slave machine. This is where all of our Selenium scripts, which will be written in Python, will be executed against various browser combinations. Two, we're going to be installing the test software on the slave machine, so this will be the browsers we're testing, Python and Selenium. Three, creating a basic Selenium script. This isn't a course about Selenium, so we're going to create quite a basic Selenium script, pretty linear and, well, basic. Step four then, we're going to configure Jenkins so that Jenkins will kick off these Selenium test automation scripts once the build of the application under test is complete. So why did we choose Selenium? Well, we're testing a browser-based application, Rocket Chat. So it seems sensible to choose Selenium as we'll need to provide test coverage against browsers like IE, Firefox, and Chrome. It's really important to point out though, this isn't a Selenium course. The scripts are really basic, but they do the job and they demonstrate how Selenium fits into this particular framework we're building. So if we're using Selenium, the next question is what language? And we're going to use Python. It's efficient, fast, easy to learn. And the demand for testers that can code in Python is growing exponentially. So Python it is. I'll be honest with you, this is probably the toughest module of the course. There's a lot of intricate stuff to be configured here. But finish this one and it's all downhill from here. <laughs>